you know. Hello. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, yes I can hear you. Oh, okay, good, great. Let me see. Okay, everybody's in. Okay. Hi, how are you? Hi, fine. Thank you. And you? How are I'm you? I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you. So, um, my name is David. Okay, nice to meet you, David. Nice to meet you. I will be your teacher. Oh. Okay. I'm Luis. You are, I'm sorry, you're Luis. Yes. Great. Okay, I have um, Gloria. I have Alexandra, Isaac, David, Oscar, Madeline, Samuel, uh, Alfaro, Foster. And um, Carlos Asensio and Luis Mesa. Correct? Hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, great, great. Okay, okay, now we're all in. Okay, so um, today's my first day with you. To, uh, today's my first day with you then. So we're going to, just today, um, I want to talk to you. I want to hear your English. I want to see how you speak, okay? Okay. Um, so to, tomorrow and, and then we'll continue with the lesson. Okay. Please hold on. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, so like I said, my name is David. Um, I live here. Uh, please, let's practice. Okay. I, I I need. We're going to practice listening. Okay. Okay. We're we're going to practice okay. listening. We're okay. going. Okay. We're going to introduce, okay. um, everybody's going to introduce yourself and we're going to listen to see how good the, pra uh, the listening was so we can practice third person. So for example, my name is David. Um, I am from San Salvador. I live here in, do you know Vista Hermosa? It's by um, the Hawar Circle. Okay. Yes. yes. Yeah. All right. Great. Um, yes, hi. We know. So, hi, Malfaro. Tell us about yourself. Who's the first? Uh, Jaime. Aviles? Jaime. Jaime Aviles. Yes. Oh, okay. My name is Jaime Aviles. I I am twenty nine years old. Um. I live in Santa Ana. I work at Tigo, El Salvador. Okay. And, and I, I am married. Oh, good. Good for you. So you're from Santa Ana and you work in Tigo. Yes. Nice. Okay. Um, remember, class, remember what Jaime said. Okay, Gloria, tell us about yourself. 
Hey teacher, my name is Gloria Navarro. I am uh, 42 years old. Uh, I am working in Timo and I am living in San Marcos. Oh, you live in San Marcos, very close. Yes, teacher. All right. Oscar Mauricio. Hey, hey hi, hi. Uh, my name is Oscar. Um, I'm work at Tigo. Uh, I'm 38 years old. Uh, I'm living near Cafetalon in Santa Tecla. Okay, hey, what happened in Santa Tecla today? Uh, it rained hard, no? Yes, it's raining hard uh, at the evening. Yes. And now it's, it's a little. Uh, it's, it's calm. Hard. It's, it's, it's calm, yes. Okay, good, good. Mm. Okay, thank you. Oh, what about you, Luis Enrique? Hello, everybody. Sorry for what I am late. No, it's okay. Um, my name is Luis Enrique Mahano. Um, 20, 20, well, um, I'm 40, 49 years old. Okay. Uh, actually, um, I am an employee. I looking for a job. Um, I am separate. I have two two childs. Two children. And, uh, two children and a boy in New York. Um, my profession is a business administration. Okay. And and I and I'm glad to to stay here in this. In this this uh, English course, and I'm trying to learn all about it. Very good, Thank very you for good. Sharing with me. Okay, excellent, very good. Um, you see, Luis Enrique, child is one. Yes. yes. Children is plural. So I have one okay. child, or I have two children, three children, children, four children. Yes. So. Okay. All right. Okay. No problem. No problem. Okay, let's go with Flor Duran. Hello. Hello, everybody. My name is Flor de Maria Duran Rivas. I live in San Vicente. I, I have um, Uh, Flor, Mary, okay. okay, Flor, I think we have a bad connection in this moment. I'm sorry, can you repeat, please? My, my name is Flor de Maria Duran. Okay. I live in San Vicente. Mm -hmm. um, I, am, I am Mary. I have a child. And this moment, I am disemployment. Disemployed. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. No problem. Okay. okay. Thank you, Flor. Okay. Next, Gloria. Gloria Navarro, are you there? Okay. Josue Perez. Okay. Hi, oh, good the, evening. Good evening, Josue. Hi, uh, my name is Jose Perez. I'm happy uh, because this girl is interesting. And I want to learn many things. I'm sure that I'm going to get it. Great. Okay, great, great. Where do you live, Josue? I live in Ciudadanos de la Libertad. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. Okay, good. And do you work? And I work for my own. I have a business. Oh, good. What business do you have? Uh, I sell products. Oh, nice. Of, of beauty to women. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you saw beauty supplies. Yeah, with my girlfriend. 
he helped me to to know more about that. Yes, you need an expert. Yeah. All right, good, thank you. Okay, um, who's next? Uh, Marcela Oviedo, hi. Hi, good evening, teacher and everybody. Um, my name is Maricela Oviedo. I'm 38 years old. I live in Santo Tomas. And I'm a lawyer. I'm independent uh, professional. Okay, good. Yes. Are you married? Yes, I am I'm married and I have a child. Only one? Only one. Okay, good. It's enough. Yeah, me too. I only have one <laughs> child. And, yeah, that's uh, enough for me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I understand perfectly. I understand. Okay, um, <laughs> Gloria Navarro, are you there? Oh, I'm sorry. I spoke with Gloria already. I'm sorry. Hi, I'm sorry, Gloria. I, I spoke with we. Okay. You introduced yourself. No okay. Okay, Josue Perez. Yeah. Oh yeah, we just spoke. I'm sorry. You see, the thing is that when somebody jumps in, my my screen rotates. Okay, David Garay, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Hi. 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 My name is David Garay. Uh, I am 36 years old. Uh, I'm living in Santa Tecla, La Libertad. And I work for Tigo. I'm okay, single. Good. good, good. All right, Alexander. <clears throat> Alexander, I'm sorry. Hi guys, my name is Alexandra Okendo. I'm 28 years old. I study psychology at the university, and nowadays I'm working in human resources area in Tigo El Salvador. I'm single, and I have a cat. Thank you. Oh, good. I'm sorry, and you said your last name is Okendo. Okendo, yes. Oh, interesting. I never heard that name before. Yeah, it's a nice one. That's yeah, <laughs> it's unique. It's unique. Nice. Sure. Thank you. And I like I like psychology, so that's good. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> yeah. Where do you study? In La Uca? No, Universidad Tecnológica de Salvador. Oh, oh okay, great, great. Mm -hmm. Okay, Madeline, are you there? Yes, um, good night, everybody. My name is Madeline Pineda. I'm 28 years old. I work at Tiwal Salvador. Um, right now, I am single. Um, I'm happy to be here um, to learn English. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought you said I'm happy to be single. <laughs> uh, no, no, I'm oh, happy too. to be here. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, good. And yes. single, too. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> but I'm happy to be single too, so. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice. Okay, great. Um, now we have um, Samuel. Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Samuel Romero. I have a uh, 33 years old. I am 30 yeah. years old. I'm sorry, uh, before this, Madeline, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Okay, Madeline, do you know, or the class in general, do you know the difference between good night and good evening? I think it's good night when you are going to sleep, I guess. <laughs> okay, good. I, I, yeah, actually, um, the two are correct, but when you say good night, it's when you're saying goodbye. Oh, okay, okay. So when you say good evening, it's when you're saying hello. The conversation. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. All Thank right. You. Cool, no problem. Okay, Samuel, um, you said I have. It's actually I am. I am. Yeah. Okay. Please uh, continue. I I am like a freelancer. I my own business. Yeah, I am. You you are a freelancer. Yeah. Yeah. What is your business? It's a the a computer support technical. And I sell them um, the old accessory, the technology. Oh, interesting. And I, 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 
work in many different uh, company and I have a, a different uh, customer and client. Okay. So, so it's very, it's very, it's very complicated, but this is, uh, yeah. it's nice. So IT is your business? Yeah, yeah. Good. It's and where it. do you live? I live in San Jacinto. It's very close. Oh, okay. <laughs> So it's very, I'm so happy to, to stay to in here and I hope to learn uh, more in English in that very is good. The, 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 the goals in, for this course. All right, interesting, nice, thank you. Carlos Asensio, are you there? Hello. Hi. Good evening, Good evening. Uh, nice to meet you all. My name is Carlos Asensio. I'm 20 years old, 26 years old, sorry. And I'm working in Tivo El Salvador and I live in Santa Tecla. Okay. So do you, all of you work, well, the majority that work in Tigo, which building, the Tigo, like the one going to the beach? Yes, in Tuscana. Tuscana, yeah, okay. Tu, Tuscana, right? Yeah. Oh, that's a beautiful zone. Yes, it's uh, a beautiful zone and it's so privacy. And in this moment, it's open? Mm, the zone, I think it's open, but, but the... No, the, the Tigo building. Tigo, no, the Tigo building, no, no, it's open. So you, you, all of you are working from home? Uh, the majority, I think. Okay. All right, good. Luis Mesa. Okay. Hi guys, nice to meet you. I'm Luis Mesa. I'm from to Apopa. I'm 36 years old. Um, I'm graphic designer. Um, okay. And currently, I work uh, in like like you. I'm I'm teacher too. I am a teacher. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. Good for you. What do you teach? Uh, um, about graphic design programs, uh, for example, uh, Photoshop, Illustrator, Design, After oh, Effects. Uh, but um, uh, currently, uh, uh, um, I have uh, other areas like uh, Microsoft Excel, uh, Access, or something like that. Okay. Very good. Thank you. So next we have uh, uh, David Garay. Yes. Hi. Hi. Tell us about yourself, uh, David. About myself. Uh, I already did, but. Oh, yeah. I'm want. sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. I'm sorry. We already spoke. Me, teacher. Elizabeth yeah. Hurtado. Yes. Okay. I still have Isaac, Alexand, oh, Alexand. Well, I'm sorry, El Elizabeth. Thank you. Um, hi, I'm Elizabeth Hurtado. I live in the Escalon. I am 39 years old. Um, I am married. I am a mother of two human children and three animal children. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I'm a communication consultant um, I I am excited because it's, it is my third English course. Oh, very good. I like your fluency. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Fortune 2. Who is Fortune 2? I have a Fortin Fortune too. That's the name. Okay. Jesse. Hi, good evening. Good evening. My name is Carla Yesenia. I live in San Vicente. I graduated of business administration, but right now I don't have a job. Okay. And I'm 34 years old. Okay. And you are you are in San Vicente in this moment? Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Francisco Grimaldi. Hi, everybody. 
Hi, uh, my name is Francisco Grimaldi. I live in Santa Tecla. Um, I'm 32 years old. And currently, I work on Tigo. I work in Tigo, okay. Tigo, yes. Well, we have a lot of people from Tigo today. Brenda? Good evening. My name is Brenda Lopez. I am 34 years old. I live in Santa Tecla. I'm single. I don't have kids. And I work for Tigo in trade marketing department. Nice. Nice. Thank you. Uh, Daniel Ramirez. Hello. You? Hello. Hello. Uh, my name is Daniel Ramirez. I am 27 years old and also I work in. Okay, good. Luis Medrano. Hello. Uh, my name is Luis Medrano. I am 28 years old and I work in human resources uh, in Tigo too. I am married and I have a daughter. Okay, very good. And Noe Rosales, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Good, good evening. Good evening. My, my name is Noe Rosales. I am 40 years old. Um, I live in Santana and I am working in Tigo. Okay, very good. Uh, somebody, everybody passed? I don't teach you. Oh, please go Fo Foster, right? Yes, Foster. I uh, like your name, evening, everyone. Foster, I like that. Oh, oh, thank you. My name is Foster Alfaro. Uh, I'm 35 years old. I'm about nine years uh, married, I've been married by about nine years. And we got two girls, and one of them is nine, and the other one, the little one, is only six months. Oh, nice! Good for you. And I work, and also work for two. Oh, okay. Nice. <clears throat> okay. Thank you. Oh, so I, we have a lot of people from Tigo here. Um, my name, well, let me tell you a little bit more about me then. So my name is David Baltrons. I um, I have been a teacher for 20 years, I think. Um, yeah, for 20 years. I am 42 years old. Currently in the day, I work in Google, but from my house in this moment, <laughs> so that's good. And um, I, I am married and I have one boy. He is four years old and no more, it's enough. He's a, he's a terrible four-year-old. <laughs> yeah, but so I don't want to have no more children, just one. <laughs> I love my, my boy very much though. <clears throat> I like my my hobbies is I I like I like rock music a lot, but classic rock. I am a very very big U2 fan. I like uh, Barcelona. I'm sorry, but I like Barcelona. I am a very big Barcelona <laughs> fan. Uh, that's nice, teacher. <laughs> Good, thank you. <laughs> and um. I will be your teacher this month. Excuse me for one second. Eh, les voy a hablar en español rapidito. Les voy a explicar algo, ¿ok? Eh, como es nuestra primera clase, obviamente no les voy a hablar español, pero solo por presenta, presentación y, y poner las expectativas. Eh, <coughs> Como les digo, he estudiado inglés, he, he, he dado clases de inglés como 20 años y he aprendido muchas cosas dando clases de inglés. Por ejemplo, permítame, he, he, dado, he aprendido muchas cosas dando clases de inglés. Por ejemplo, he aprendido de que el inglés no se estudia, se aprende. O sea que ustedes tienen que... Eh, Aprenderlo. ¿Y cómo se aprende? Practicándolo. ¿Cómo se practica? 
haciendo preguntas y respuestas. Ok. Lo que pasa es, les voy a dar un ejemplo. En inglés hay tres cosas que son fundamentales. Y las tres tienen que estar niveladas. Pero es bien raro que alguien las tenga niveladas porque están así, así. ¿Qué son? La fluidez, la comprensión y la gramática. ¿Saben cuántas veces he escuchado esto? Profe, mi problema es que yo entiendo todo, a mí me cuesta hablarlo. Uh, siempre. Pero el problema es también porque quizás nuestra cultura en El Salvador, nosotros, um, nosotros hablamos todo en diminutivo. Nosotros decimos leak, voy a la U. O, ¿Me entienden? Y a veces hablamos bien corto, solo con palabras. Por ejemplo, hey, ¿qué tal? ¿Qué tal? Te, ¿Cómo te fue el fin de semana? Tranquilo. La casa. Sí o no, a veces respondemos así, la casa, pero ahí queremos darme a entender. No hicimos nada, ahí estuve en la casa. Ahora, eso, eh, porque así es nuestra cultura y no es malo, pero cuando es la cultura de hablar, si nosotros decimos eso en inglés y, y lo hacen, hi, how was your weekend? My house. Ahí se cambia porque nada decir what? Huh? My house, what? My house. Y ahí es donde empieza el famoso problema es que a mí me cuesta hablarlo, pero sí lo entiendo. ¿Por qué? Porque solo hablamos por palabras. Entonces, yo le voy a pedir un favor, que todo me contesten en forma completa. Si le digo, what is your name? No me digan, Oscar. No, my name is Oscar. Are you married? Yes. No, yes, I am. Where do you work? Tigo. I work in Tigo. ¿Por qué? Quiero que me contesten completo porque ahí estoy oyendo su gramática. Estuve oyendo bastantes como equivocaciones, como el I am y las típicas, pero eso no hay problema, no tengan pena. Lo único que sí espero que sepan que yo lo voy a corregir y no se vayan a enojar. <risa> o o sea, no se vayan a molestar. Yo siempre lo voy a corregir porque quiero que hablen bien. Y también espero que siempre, siempre tengan preguntas. Porque es otro problema que a veces no, no, no preguntan. ¿Me entienden? Y le voy a dar un ejemplo. What is your name? José. Are you married? No. Where do you live, José? Santa Tecla. And where do you work? Digo, me quedo, wow, José, bueno, entiende. Realmente, no sé por qué solo me dijo José, no, Santa Tecla y Tigo. Incluso las palabras, o sea, me quedo, hmm. Pero eso sí, por lo menos sé que José tiene buena comprensión. Porque me entendió, nunca me dijo, what? What? Repeat? No. Ok, pero si yo le digo, ok, José, now, answer complete. What is your name? My name is José. Are you married? Yes, I do. Mm -mm. Uh, no, no, I don't, dijo él. Where do you live? I am doing living in Santa Tecla. Where do you work? I am working in doing in Tigo. Hmm. Ah, boom, ya descubrí cuál es el problema de José. No es su fluidez y no es su comprensión, es su gramática. Entonces, con Josué me gustaría practicar solo gramática. ¿Me entienden? Así es cuando uno busca, va buscando, va buscando las palabras donde, o, o sea, va buscando lo, los puntos donde mejorar con alguien. ¿Ok? So, eh, eso, eso es lo que yo espero de ustedes. Espero que ustedes también me hagan a mí muchas preguntas. Nunca hay una pregunta tonta o que les dé pena en algo. De verdad, eso sí es mala onda. Hay mucha gente que no sé por qué les da pena. Siempre háganla. Cualquier duda. Fíjense que yo de tanto dar clases que yo, yo me echo así. Cuando voy a aprender yo algo nuevo, yo siempre pregunto. Eh, tal, tal, porque me, me gusta estar bien seguro de lo que estoy. Porque yo sé que si no estoy entendiendo hoy, 
no voy a entender mañana, ni la otra semana, ni, ni el otro mes. ¿Me entienden? Entonces, tengo que ir entendiendo. Hay que hacer la curva. ¿Cómo es? Nivelarla. Ok. Um, casi todos los tengo, están en mudo. Pero, ¿entienden? ¿Ya? Yeah. Sí. Yes. Okay. Otro otro problema que se lo oía muchos hoy, y como les digo, aquí para hacer dos pájaros de un tiro es la diferencia del acento de inglés y español que nosotros hablamos del estómago. El inglés se habla de los labios. Incluso la misma palabra la decimos mal porque nosotros, miren, no sé si me están viendo, nosotros decimos así, la bios. Solo usamos un labio de abajo. Y la mente la ve grande, se usan los dos. Pero si nosotros decimos la bio, hasta se siente raro, la bio. Pero, ¿por qué? Porque hablamos mal el español. O sea, nosotros decimos la vaca, vení. Eh, mi apellido, mi apellido es Baltrons, con B grande. Siempre que pido una pizza o algo, me dicen B grande o B pequeña. Ese error nunca, nunca lo van a oír en inglés. Nadie le va a decir Big B o Little B. Porque el acento en inglés se define en los labios. En español se define en, los, en el estómago por el acento. Vení, vení. Le voy a dar un ejemplo. Uh, muchos me estaban diciendo, my name is. Es imposible decir la M en inglés y en español sin cerrar la boca. M. M. Mm. Pero muchos me dijeron, my name is. La M con la boca abierta. Y no, y, y, y como les digo, eso es, 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 es un, una, un error común, pero mejorémoslo porque si era, en eso es lo que les digo, cuando lo oigo, se lo voy a ir corrigiendo. My name is. Uh -huh. Y si a eso les cuesta, my name es, díganlo largo, my name is. My name, my name is. Hasta que se les quede. My name is. Ok. Entonces, eso, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Eso, eso es el truco de, del idioma inglés. Se aprende, no se estudia. Creo que todo... Y, ¿Y por qué se aprende? Porque es una habilidad que van a adquirir. Van a aprender a hablar otro idioma. Y siempre que ustedes adquieren una habilidad, no la estudian. Bueno, sí la pueden estudiar, pero estudiando no lo van a aprender si no lo practican. Les apuesto que ustedes aprendieron a manejar sin estudiar. Aprendieron a bailar cocinar, todo lo que es una actividad, eh, planchar, lavar, para eso nos estudia, entonces aquí van a aprender a hablar. <coughs> okay. eh, ahorita me interesa más que hablen, que escribir y leer, siempre obviamente lo vamos a hacer, pero no podemos, no podemos escribir y leer algo que no podemos hablar, primero se habla, y después se escribe y lee, porque irónicamente los dos se aprenden juntos. Si yo les pregunto a ustedes, ¿qué aprendieron primero, leer o escribir? No se acuerdan. Se van a quedar, eh, no, sí. se aprenden juntos. Pero obviamente nunca lo hubieran aprendido los dos juntos si no lo podían hablar primero. ¿Ya? Entonces, ¿tienen alguna pregunta ustedes? De momento, no. Ok. No. No, teacher. No, thank teacher. No, okay. No, thank, teacher. thank you for your advices. Okay, no, no problem. Okay, so um, so the thing is, in first person is my name. That's very important. My name, his name, and her name. Yes. Yeah. Um, let me see if I remember. Marcela, are you there? Disculpen una pregunta. ¿Se conocen algunos de ustedes? No. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. No. 
Okay. Los de Tigo, me imagino. Caras familiares. Los Lee and Tigo, yes. Yeah. The, the Tigo, Tigo people. Co-workers. <laughs> okay, the Tigo co-workers. Okay. Okay, the Tigo co-workers. Okay. So, for example, Marcela. Hello, Marcela. Oviedo. Maricela. Oh, I'm sorry, Maricela. I'm sorry. I need my glasses. <laughs> Maricela, do you remember um, who? Do you remember Gloria? Gloria, no. She's here, Gloria Navarro. No, I don't remember. Um, so in the last course, we don't have a um cam. Oh, you don't on, have cameras? On cam. No, so, no. So in this moment, you only can see me? No, I can see a lot of people, but no everybody. Okay, not everybody. Okay, no problem. Okay, but now I we're don't going... know anybody. <laughs> okay, um, what I want to do is practice the third person then. Okay, so... Um, I'm um, sorry, Maricela, I forgot. You told me you are a lawyer, correct? Yes, it is. You're, and you work yes, in... Yes, I am. You work in Santo Tomas, correct? I'm living in Santo Tomas. You, I'm sorry, I you, work, you live in Santo Tomas. Yes, I have two offices. One here and another one in San Salvador. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, so, you, so you're independent. Yes, I'm independent lawyer. Okay, and are you married? Yes, I am married. And you only have one child, I remember. You have a um, nice memory. Yes, I am uh, one child. Okay, good. Yes. Oh, yeah. But no, I don't have a good memory. I will forget in two minutes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Gloria. Yes, teacher. Hi. So did you listen to my conversation with Maricela? But a little because uh, in this moment it's start raining. It's raining. Okay, yes, yes, I but can hear. I have a little. I remember the chief say. No, wait, wait, no, but I'm going to ask you a question. Don't tell me what you remember. Uh, okay. So tell me if yes or no, or does, Mar does Maricela work? In Santa Ana? Marcela Okay, but answer my question. Does I, I want to hear your auxiliaries, okay? Does Maricela work in Santa Ana? She does in Santa Ana. So yes she does or no she doesn't? No, she doesn't. Okay, very good. No, she doesn't. Okay, thank you. Where does she work? She, uh, she works in San Salvador. Only? Santo Tomas? Yeah. She only works in San Salvador? No. Uh, uh, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, remember she says she has two offices. She yeah. has one in San Salvador and she has one in Santo Tomas. Okay, okay thank you, Gloria. Okay, all right, Luis Enrique Mahano, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Okay, is Maricela divorced? Mm, I don't remember. Uh, not, I not remember, teacher. Okay, Sorry. ask her, ask her. Maricela? Yes. Are, are you there? <laughs> Good. Yes, no. I am here. Okay. Are you are you married? 
Yes, I am married. Okay. Congratulations. So Luis, <laughs> okay. so Luis, is she divorced? Oh, okay. I don't remember. You just asked her. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry? You you just asked her if she's married. She said yes. Yes, but it, so so said, she, she divorced. Yes. No, um, I didn't say she's divorced. I am asking you. Is she ah. divorced? No, she doesn't. Oh, no, she doesn't or no, she isn't? Okay. No, she isn't. Very good. Very good. You see, Luis, listen to the auxiliary because I said, is she married? So, yes, she is or no, she isn't. If yes. the question starts with does, like does she work, then the answer is, Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Okay. So depending on the auxiliary, that is the question. That is the answer. That is the answer. Okay. All right. Good. Oscar. Hello. Hello, sir. So tell me, um, Maricela lives in, I'm sorry, is, where does Maricela live? Okay. I think she is living in Santo Tomas. Okay. She is living or she lives? She lives. Okay, good. She lives in Santo Tomas, okay. With her cat? I don't remember a cat, Maricela. <laughs> do you have a cat? No, I don't. I don't so, have a cat. So, <laughs> that's, that's very good though. But um, according <laughs> to the conversation, where do you think Maricela lives? Um, um, who does she live with? Um... Sorry, I, I don't understand the, the questions. So remember my conversation with Maricela? Mm -hmm. um, who do you think she lives with? I think uh, she lives with his husband and his, his child. His child, okay, but her his, child. his her or her? Her, her child. child. Sorry. Yeah, her, her, her husband and her child. Her child, very good, yes, good. Yeah, remember, it has to be his and her, his and her. Yeah. All right, nice. Foster. Yes, teacher. Foster, why, where's your name from, Foster? <laughs> well, well, it's an American name, but my, in my case, it's um, Nicaragua, Nicaragua. Oh, okay, are you from Nicaragua? No, uh, a friend from my father. Uh, his name was was or is I don't uh, I don't know because I don't know if if he's uh, liver or dead. Okay, if he's so dead. <clears throat> his name is Foster. So they were very close and in honor. Uh, he decided to call me Foster. Oh, that's very good. That's very good. It's a good thing his name wasn't Toribio. <laughs> imagine, imagine if if your father's friend name was Toribio. Oh man. <laughs> so he. So it's a good thing his name was Foster. There is yes, a there, I guess. there is a rock group. It's called Foster the People. Have you heard that group? Yes. Almost, almost, uh, my fr all my friends say, tell me that. Foster the people. Yeah, it's a good group. Foster the people. Yes, I, I heard it. Mm -hmm. And um, you told me that you work in Tigo, correct? Yeah, that's right. What do you do in Tigo? I, uh, well, I'm in trade marketing uh, also with my, my co-worker, Brenda Lopez, right here. Oh, okay. Um, yes. And where do you live? Oh, I live in San Marcos. In what part of San Marcos do you live? San Marcos, uh, near from uh, Terminal del Sur. Okay, good. Or oh, you say near or from? You just say near, near Terminal del Sur. Oh, near. Okay, good. Okay. All right, nice. So let's see, Jaime. 
Jaime, why is his name Foster? Or remember, just try to give me a very simple explanation. Don't don't complicate yourself. Okay. I think for his father name or in honor of of his father. Mm. Of his father. He fifty percent. It's not his father. Is his father's friend? His father. <laughs> friend. Oh, I don't hear. Yeah. This, but... So yeah, his name is Foster in honor of his father's friend. His father's friends. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Luis Mesa, are you there? Yes. So is the original Foster is the original Foster alive or dead? Sorry, can you repeat? What happened to the original Foster? Is he alive or dead? Uh, I guess because um, uh, uh, it's this from Nicaragua. Yes. I guess. Is he alive or dead? Remember what Foster said? No, I don't remember. Yeah. Who remembers? He doesn't he, know. He doesn't know. Yes. Yeah. We don't know. <laughs> yeah. He said he doesn't know. He, he doesn't know. He doesn't know if he's alive or dead. <laughs> All right, good. You see, this is practicing your listening skills. All right, good. David Garay. Yes. Where does um where does Foster live? Near of Terminal del Sur in San Marcos. Near of or only near? Near. Near, sorry. No, no, don't say sorry. It's okay. He he lives near Terminal del Sur. Yes. In San Marcos. In San Marcos. And I'm where sorry. does Maricela live? Teacher. Maricela lives in Santo Tomas. Santo Tomas. Very good, thank you. Yes, Elizabeth. What is near? Oh, good. Near is close. Ah, okay. okay. Yes, it's for directions. So, for example, I live in Vista Hermosa and it's near the Paso del Jaguar. Okay. It's very okay. near. I understand. Okay. Okay, good. Good question. Thank you. Uh, Elizabeth. Mm, yes. Hi, I'm sorry. Where do you live? In the, I live in the Escalón. Where in the Escalón? Um... For, um, near? Near, uh, the, I, I don't know, how do you say, Redondel? Circle? Uh, I live near uh, Mas Ferrer Circle. Oh, okay. Very good. And what do you do, uh, where do you work? I am communication consultant. I am communication consultant. Okay, are you married? Yes, I am. Yes, I am married. And you have three human children, I remember. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> three, human, three human children and three animals children. <laughs> and what are the three animals you have? Uh, two dogs and one cat. Oh, okay. La lady dogs. How do you say... <laughs> Perritas, perras. The, the sex? Uh -huh. Really? Really? The, the original name is bitch. Ah, okay. Yes. <laughs> but right now it's a... a <laughs> you have two a bitches. Word. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a bad word, but you can actually see it in the dictionary. In the dictionary, a bitch is a female dog. I have two bitches. <laughs> Yeah, you have two bitches. <laughs> and one cat. Yeah. <laughs> no, but yeah. My, I, I, I prefer lady dogs. Yeah, no, you, actually you say female. Female, uh, female dogs. You female have two female dogs. dogs. Mm -hmm. In fact, if, if you look at, in the dictionary, it says bitch. The, the um, definition is female dog. Okay. <laughs> okay. And one cat. One cat. Oh, I... 
I don't hate cats, but I have a very big problem with cats at this moment <clears throat> in my house. Yes, I know. All, all, all people <laughs> don't like cats. <laughs> no, no, but you know, the problem is my neighbor, the, the neighbor in front of my house, every day, well, she is a cat lover. So that's good. But every day she puts food and water outside for the cats. Mm. So in my block, in my block, there are maybe six houses or seven. And sometimes you open the door and there are 20 cats in the block. Oh my God. Yes. And it's, it's street cats. Yes, and my house is the personal bathroom of the cats. Oh my god! <laughs> but if you if you put lemon, uh, las cascaras, the skin, the skin, uh, the lemon skin, so the cats uh, live. Yeah, but I read that cats don't like citric citrus and. and Mm -hmm. But no, uh, every, and pepper too. Every Lemon, day. pepper, uh, vinagre. Vinegar, yes. Vinegar. But the cats is not the problem. My neighbor is the problem. Ultimate <laughs> <laughs> dinner. Because he eat, he ate, he. She. <clears throat> she. Let's da she. Uh, give. She give. Give them she food. She give give them. Food. Eight. Food. 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 Yes, and that's and 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 they're all baby cats. They're all kittens. So sometimes I get very, very angry, but when I see the babies, oh <laughs> but no. But I, I don't like cats in no, this moment. I, I I understand. Okay. <laughs> no, my cat my cat don't uh, 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 he eat. It always uh, stay in house. Oh, you, yeah, that's good. So you are a responsible. Uh, because he's my because he's my son. It's your son. Okay, good. <laughs> and what is your cat? This is name? the reason. Mi, Mishu Tom. Mishu Tom. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Prince, <laughs> Francisco Grimaldi. Hi. Hi. Where does Elizabeth live? She lives in Colonia Escalón. So who is Misho Tom, her cat or her dog? Her cat. Answer okay. complete. Answer complete, please. <laughs> uh, Misho Tom? No, Misho Tom is her cat. Misho Tom is her cat. All right. And what about her dogs? What are they? Female or males? Uh, her dogs are female. Okay. So she has two bitches? Uh, <clears throat> she, she have two bitches, yes. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> yeah. That's actually, it, it is correct, but more formal is she has two female dogs. So that's good. All right. Brenda. Brenda. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Brenda. Hi. I'm sorry, Brenda. I forgot. Are you married? No, I'm, I'm not married. Oh, okay. What do you do? I work for Tivo. Oh, yeah. I remember First that. Foster is my co-worker. You're a happy single. Yes. Oh, yeah. Very happy. <laughs> <laughs> Just lying. <laughs> I can sleep all night. I don't have children you know you know sometimes i stop and think wow with this quarantine i remember my days when i was single <laughs> wow that would have been perfect <laughs> wow imagine. Uh, but i think that, that the kids are very cute do you have children no i <laughs> no i don't oh. but i have a how do you say you don't know. Dina? <laughs> uh, you have a niece. Yes. 
No, chil time. children are beautiful. Yes, they're very nice. But sometimes a vacation is necessary. <laughs> no, Unnecessary? It's necessary. It's mandatory. <laughs> my son, my son is like the exorcist. <laughs> because like Shoki. Why did you? Because, like Shoki. Yes, because he wakes up at 6 30 in the morning every day, but like this. Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> like, and jumps and jumping. He, he doesn't wake up lazy, like, no, he just wakes up like, boom. And let's play, let's play, let's play at 6 30. How, how old he is? Is he? Is he? He is How four. Is he? he is four. Four. Oh, okay. That's a lot of energy. It's too much. It's, <laughs> it's, it's amazing. It's good, but it's bad too. <laughs> it's tired. Yeah. And, and the problem is my, my block, I heard that <laughs> one of my neighbors, she possibly has COVID. Ooh. So my son doesn't go out for nothing like at all <laughs> so before i used to play outside with him with the motorcycle with the bicycle and now nothing so he's more crazy now yeah. <laughs> it's too dangerous yeah it's too dangerous poor baby poor me <laughs> <laughs> for everybody in your house yeah no, but sometimes I think, wow, imagine this pandemia when I was single. I would sleep all day, sleep until five in the morning. It would make me cry. Yes. <laughs> Don't talk about that. <laughs> yeah. no, but, um, no, but I can't because I work in Google. So at six in the morning, I have to be in my computer. But it's it's okay because at six in the morning I just put on and I go back to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, my computer is next to my bed, so so when I have a message, ding ding, I go, hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, okay, uh, very good. Listen, so thank you for for today. I I just want to hear you speak. Okay, so. Tomorrow, we're going to start the real lesson. And like I told you, my expectations from you is please ask me questions. Um, please expect me to correct you when, when I hear a mistake. I will correct you. Okay. Uh, okay. And always ask me questions, okay? And remember, be active. In English, you have to be active, not only passive. Not only passive, because this is normal. Do you understand? Yes. Questions? No. Come on, no. Always mm -hmm. participate. Always participate, okay? okay. So okay. I, will, I will see you tomorrow, and we'll start the class, the, the, the lesson plan tomorrow, okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank I like, you. I like, Thank you. Thank you. I like everybody's level today, okay? Thank so. you. Hey, good, night. Thank you. Good, night. good night. Bye, everybody. Okay, now, good yes, it's good night. It's good night. <laughs> now it's good night. Okay. Okay. Bye. All right, bye. Take bye. care. Bye. Bye. -bye.